So step one of making a comp door, we start off with the solid timber slab. Basically, it has only one species of timber inside, so therefore that helps massively with the bowing issues that some solid timber composite doors have, but more importantly, it helps us achieve the uh, 1.4U value, which um, we get a standard on all our doors. Once we have the slab, we send it onto the um, first part of the CNC. So on this CNC operation, we actually router out the details for the cassettes, the glazing options, and also the letter boxes. So depending on what the customers chose for the door, this basically is the first prep for the door itself. The door then goes on to its first stage, which will actually be the edge banding. So we edge band our doors um, first, and this ensures that when the skins are put on top of the actual um, slab itself, that you can't see the edge banding around the side. Once the door's been edge banded, we um, then um, go into the process of skinning the actual door itself. So um, our skins are PVC and they are foiled with the cool foil technology. So this basically repels the heat away from the door. Because the door skins themselves are foiled, it means they perfectly match a foiled frame exactly. So the skins are vacuum formed in a vacuum form. Basically that will give us the detail, for example, this door behind us, with the bark detail and the, um, uh, the, the, the recess detail that you see on the door itself. So once it's been vacuum formed, the door then goes on to a process where it's actually glued. So we use a unique process which is called our adhere process where it's automated. We um, apply the glue onto the skin um, and spray it with water to um, activate the actual gluing process. That's a unique process to us. Everyone else in the market generally um, has a person spraying this uh, door skin so that can lead to problems with delamination. That process itself sets our door apart from the rest of the market because um, we massively reduce the delamination um, that happens or can happen within the doors. So to date at the moment we have not had a problem with delamination on any of our doors at all. So once the um, skins have been gone, gone through the adhere process we then um, bond the skins to the slab. So essentially we put the skins, marry the skins up to the slab and then we have a press that presses the actual skins down to the uh, slab itself and that obviously starts the bonding process. So the actual skins themselves are bonded front and back to the slab. We then take it away and all the excess skin is actually trimmed off um, from the door itself. We then put the door slab and the skins into the second part of the CNC process. This is where obviously the lock detail and other features are obviously routed into the door slab itself. The door slab then goes over to furnishing where we put the bells and whistles and such onto the door itself to give it its unique features. We then send the door over to hanging. Um, the door is then basically hung into um, our outer frame which is um, been welded again in-house here at Comp Door. The last process of um, manufacture is once the door's been hung into the actual frame, it then goes to glazing where we put the glass and the cassettes on and finally the door's then wrapped completely for protection for um, distribution. So with Comp Door, you're guaranteed quality because all the products that we use for manufacturing of our door um, are the best available in the market and the process that we use to manufacture are the most advanced to date. With that, you get guarantee um, of the best service, best product available, and all this is manufactured in the UK, in Stoke.